previously on. I think your DLC obsession's gotten out of hand. It's just funny because he doesn't know how right he is yet. And now this. Also play bad ending. I tried it. Does she even know how to write? What are you doing here, Monica? You weren't ever on the whole mini game. Get out of here. You know, for someone who has been historically terrible at rhythm games, I'm actually doing really well for a change. This is a really good omen to start the video off. I, I, I should just stop talking. I mean, your tongue has led you to failure. What are you talking about? It, it, I never failed once in this game. You keep telling yourself that. I have perfected every single song I have ever played in a rhythm game. God. I wasn't expecting you to write something so expl- <laughs> Okay. Well great, we just started and she already demonetized everything. I thought Pokemon was a children's game! And then he said, but FNF isn't. People will find any excuse to make a Pokemon not for kids. Ugh. Like, whether it's through just adding violence, or just making it ridiculously hard like Emerald Kaizo. Oh, yeah. Like, I'm, I'm a masochist, but I'm nowhere near enough of a masochist yet to play Emerald Kaizo. <gasps> Sunday?! Oh my god, that's Sunday. How could you tell from just a silhouette? <laughs> While I was there, I had a nice chat with someone who shared a similar interest in collecting. Oh god! Say hi, Zipper! <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> what the <laughs> What is this? Alright, uh, heads or tails? Uh, uh Natsuki. Okay. I picked Yuri. <laughs> I love you so much. Yeah, I know, I'm great. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, for whatever reason, this song is like one of the hardest in the game. <laughs> so, a song that is literally just an argument gone horribly, horribly wrong is harder than the deranged alien, huh? I'm surprised you managed to actually make it through the song without failing. Same. That's a feat within itself. Same. As for the fourth song... Well... Oh no. Oh no. Uh, where's the restraining order? So Monica, according to canon, was a genuinely good person before she realized uh, nothing was real, uh, decided murdering her friends was a good idea. What would happen if someone who has no moral compass got this power? The day of reckoning. Alright, uh, that- the story over. She said no, that's it. That's where it ends. I have a gut feeling it's not gonna be that way. That looks so cursed. Oh god. Ew. Ew. He should not look not pixelated. This is the equivalent of upgrade, and then fuck, go back. Lock. L. Ratio. Boo this man. Boo! With all the side stories done, it was time to go after all the costumes, and just from playing the game normally, you'll inevitably unlock at least one of them. So at this point, I was thinking, hey, it can't be that hard to unlock all of them, right? Right? Okay, get an accuracy of... What? I need to get an accuracy Holy of 90- Holy shit, she's kinda built! I need an accuracy of 90%? Oh wow. Are you kidding me? Well, I think now's a good time as ever to say, uh, uh, how do I say this? Uh -huh. skill issue. I didn't even get started yet! Thankfully, not every single one of these costumes was just the American education system. You could just click on some of them and get them for free. <laughs> what the, what the hell is this? Oh my- <laughs> And others quite literally require you to do absolutely nothing.
<laughs> and then he dies? So, what you're telling me is that this guy is so horny that not getting a girl kills him. Okay. So on the topic of easy to get costumes, you can get all the costumes from the 4 in 1 song you and me really easily so long as you pick all the 3 girls you didn't pick into the main story, which is basically just the game telling you that you're a massive simp no matter what you try to do. Wait, what does that say about- Alright, uh, who should- who should I pick first? Uh, Natsuki? Oh! So that's that Phantom Thief Monica thing I keep seeing. So after running that joke clean into the ground, finally, time to actually get Natsuki's costume. Ah uh, yes, everyone's favorite waifu, Alucard! Hey, you wanna see the reason why you can't use the costumes in the main story? Here you go! This... This doesn't feel right. It's not weird for your girlfriend to dress as someone's mo- What?! Eh? I have so many questions! I don't know, she looks kinda clean. I mean, she does, but the description throws me off slightly. This just in, local phantom thief beats up a plush cow. Okay, wait, now you just look more like a catchy- Why am I- More like tilted, am I right? Got him. <laughs> Th that was so bad. This is just the plot of like so many side quests in Persona 5, actually. That's honestly concerning. I don't know, there are some parts of it that remind me of this one song. I don't think you know it though. Um, it's called I Can't Decide by the Scissor Sisters. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Oh, spooky. What? I was joking when I said Basil! That song is so good, though. It's really good. And here we are! Wait, what? I have to press them? We are. And here we are. And here we are. And here we are. Automatic language detected. What? Oh, I, I just died because I suck. And here we are. And here we are. And here we are. Let's meet our new specimen. IDF 86! I feel like a specimen. I will say, Frontiers has. Frontiers fucking boss themes are bangers. Like, I, I think going the sleeping with sirens direction is the right move if we're going for, like, modern Sonic. Yeah, Sonic uh, Frontiers' boss themes are just, like, comparable to Metal Gear Rising's. And here we are! I almost fell for the instant death trap again. I never learn. For a bit of context, when I played the main story, this song gave me trouble for 20 minutes. Yeah, I know there was, like, jump scares in one song in this mod. I think it might have been one of the Yuri songs because, well, it's Yuri. <laughs> Miss. Where's the mute key? So understandably, I wasn't enthused to be back here. If I never have to hear this song again after this video, I that that should be great. I can't even beat the song! Would you like me to say it? No. Don't. Do not. 
please for the love of god have some mercy. Only 75%, oh god. Damn. 75 Can I say it? No, you are- you cannot say it. Maybe I'll be able to get 90% on this one, cause that, I'm not even gonna try with the other one. <laughs> Oh wait, I, I, for, I forgot I was on the mirror mode. <laughs> I give up. I'm so good. How did I get so good? Oh wow. Oh my god. The level that he's playing is so professional. I know, I got so much better after just one attempt. There's no way this actually works, right? I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Of course it didn't work. Is- are there still more songs? Oh wait, I haven't done this one yet! Yes, more delaying the inept- Unfortunately, there really wasn't all that much delaying the inept- I could really do. There were three bonus songs, and while they were decently long, I burned through them way too quickly for my liking. You know what? No. If if I have to suffer, so do you. What are you talking about? I picked Epiphany, the song with the jump scare. You know, I, I love you. I'm so glad we're friends, and I'm so glad you brought me on here to do this. There are so many insta-kill notes. Why? Supposed to be the troll song. Hmm. Three, two, one, go. Swear to god, I will beat this freaking song. You know what, maybe I should just hit the insta-kill notes just to, to- just force the jump scare to show up. If I get super frustrated, I'm doing that. Oh, you're so good at keeping your composure. What are you talking about? My composure is excellent. I'm telling you. Even you agree. This is the furthest I made this in this song. <laughs> Why do I talk? Why do I just talk ever? You know what? Maybe those people were right. Maybe Monica is pure evil. I'm genuinely wondering how many of these I failed because I just suck and how many I clicked the insta-kill notes for. Okay, I think that was safe to say that was an insta-kill. Of course, because the topic is kind of inevitable when you're playing an FNF mod. Uh, we started talking about some less than savory developers. I don't know if he's improved since then, but I, I like to think he's become a better person. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know what's not getting better, though? You! <laughs> okay, <laughs> you didn't have to say it like that! Oh, you were waiting for me to say it. No, it would've been funnier if you just didn't answer! So what I didn't know at the time was that you could actually make the song easier, relatively speaking, by knocking the speed down. Why didn't I think to do this at the time? I don't know. I'm stupid, I guess. Oh, and by the way, you want to know what you get for beating the song? The same song again! Only Juno happened to it, Monica's wearing a dress, I guess! And there's no insta-kill notes! And as a reward for all of that, you know how to know what you get? <laughs> this! What do you mean the song made me tilted? No, no, I'm totally okay, I'm definitely okay! <sighs> the love of God... One of these days, I'm gonna get the 1 in 50 jump scare, and I will get my revenge on you. <laughs> this is agony, this is- Whose idea was this? Yours. I, I know.
anytime I'm suffering, I just have to remember, yeah, this is my own idea. I, I'm the one who signed on to do this. I'm just gonna say it. Ninja Gaiden for the NES was easier than this. Oh, wow. Yes, I actually beat that game. It only took me five years, but, you know. <laughs> what?! I made it back here again. Cool. Nope. I was about to say no instant death notes, really? And then one showed up and killed me. Why do I- why- where's the duct tape? Where's- do I have duct tape? Dang it, I don't. Okay, once this song is done, I'm actually chucking my Monica Nendroid in the trash. Really? But after that one, I did the unthinkable. Also, just realized I've gotten to the point where I think beating this song at all is easier than perfecting any of the other songs. I say that and instantly die. Are you freaking kidding me? I'm so done. I'm so done. <laughs> Ninja Gaiden NES sending you back to the first level in a world when you try and beat the final boss and fail? No, this is... No, I just try a four minute long song where, like, there's... If you mess up even slightly one time, you die. I swear, I'm gonna be rolling that Natsuki clip constantly throughout this video. Really? Okay, no, I'm genuinely getting upset. <laughs> I need a drink. I'll be back. Where- when in my life did I- At what point in my life did I get to a point where I thought, Yeah, funny rhythm game, based on a game- based on a bait-and-switch visual novel that traumatized me when I was a teenager. Yeah, this would be great for my YouTube channel. Utterly fantastic. I was just contemplating my pat- my terrible life choices. Wait, what are we- Oh yeah, turns out if you click that shaker on the menu, um, there's another song. Oh! I have no idea who this is. And also, I specifically waited to continue Epiphany for when you come back in case I get the jump scare. You're so thoughtful. <laughs> I'm such a great friend, I know. I gently opened the door. Screw you, game! You. It's not like I made the gently open the door joke concept. How many pogs are there? Too many to count. Point, someone rapped here. Oh, you don't say. Baller song. What the heck? Unrecognized da data discovered in the side stories menu. Okay. Hmm? Well, at least it'll hopefully be easier than all the other stuff I was doing. Alright, what's the deal here? Please load.
ne is this a pl that's the company that was introduced in ddlc plus what is is this a reference to what, what would they reference here creepy what project living oh it's that thing I distinctly remember watching a Game Theory video on this years ago. But that's this just... isn't the bad ending, though. What is happening? I think... What on Earth? Oh my god! What is happening? I do not know. How is this linked to Doki Doki? Uh, I don't know. I just remember Libertina or whatever had something to do. Someone found like Libertina or something in the code of the original DLC. And, uh, fan theorists went nuts. What is this? Whoa. This art style. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, this looks like Juno. So after that utter bizarro episode, came one last costume, yeah, I bet you forgot this was what this video was about for a bit, and a letter from the developer. And, honestly, I think this is a good note to end this video on. Is what I would say, if it weren't for the fact that I am exceedingly petty. Dang it, I was really hoping I'd get the jump scare right there. If I died. <laughs> that would have been so funny. Why don't you hit the note on purpose? Bet. <laughs> Didn't work. <laughs> I'm just gonna actually try now. <laughs> okay, you can say it now. Skill issues!